Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Charles Babbitt began his career as surveyor in Natchez before the Civil War. When hostilities broke out, he joined the Confederate Army, and by the spring of 1865, he was a first lieutenant in the 1st Regiment Engineer Troops for the Army of Northern Virginia. Babbitt was present at Appomattox Courthouse when Lee surrendered to Grant. In describing the momentous event, Babbitt wrote the following, Many a head was drooped in sadness that the cause was lost and doomed, but still there was a feeling of relief when we reflected that we had done all that was in our power to do and that blood and carnage were at the end. Babbitt noted that when Lee issued his farewell address and returned with his sword still at his side, the troops learned of the liberal and high-toned manner in which he had been received by General Grant, and that the terms of the surrender granted to us through him, I assure you that many a bitter thought was burned into oblivion. Babbitt goes on to describe the atmosphere among the troops after the surrender. The blue and the gray were seated around the campfire, smoking and chatting as socially as though they belonged to the same army. After the war, Babbitt returned to Natchez and would go on to create one of the most important collections of detailed maps and surveys of the Natchez district. Hi, I'm David Gardner. I'm a retired city engineer for the city of Natchez. And this has been your Natchez History Minute.